When the Porsche 964 Carrera 4 was introduced in 1989, it was the first Porsche 911 with all-wheel drive. That was a revolution at the time, but by today's standards, the system was unfortunately very complex and, above all, heavy. The additional weight is 100 kg. And you can also see from the current prices that the rear-wheel drive Carrera 2 achieves significantly higher prices than its all-wheel drive brother. If you then have a 964 without sunroof and with manual transmission, you own the holy grail. That's why I was motivated to convert my Carrera 4 into a Carrera 2. And this video should help you understand what it takes. The transmissions in the Carrera 4 and Carrera 2 are quite similar, but have two different type names. In the Carrera 4, the transmission is called G64, and in the Carrera 2, it's called uh, G50. And if you want to convert from uh, all-wheel drive to rear-wheel drive, then of course the first question you ask to yourself is whether you can convert the G64 into a G50. And the answer is yes, it's possible, but unfortunately not so easy and not uh, simply by leaving out uh, parts. There are companies that offer conversions, but the conversion is very complex and expensive. And in the end, you have a compromise. And that's why I decided to buy a used G50 transmission. Uh, but unfortunately, the choice is not so big and the prices are very high. So you have to spend between 5,000 uh, up to 8,000 euro for a standard G50 gearbox nowadays. But with the gearbox alone, it is not done. You also need the Carrera 2 front axle or at least the outer joints of the Carrera 4 drive shafts, which are fortunately available as spare parts. And on the rear axle, you need the drive shafts of the Carrera 2 because the screws have M10 instead of M8 thread and the bolt circle of the flange is different. The gear shift is also a separate issue. Due to the elimination of the 25 kg heavy central tube, the complete shift actuator mechanism is missing here. For this topic, I'll make another se separate video. But just so much in advance, I have taken the rear shift rod from the Carrera 2 and the uh, shift linkage from the US uh, company Renline. And uh, the installation was anything but easy, so some adjustments were necessary. One, no collision. Two, three, four, five. 